all right so what is going on youtube today we will be going in with some shirinu uh, shirinu shadows um because random i accent another deck in and we're done with dark synchro even though i really do enjoy that deck i may revisit it later on but for right now we're going to switch it up uh we're going to be playing this because he said hey play something yeah how about you play something you, you know i know you're going to be comfortable with and i am comfortable with this uh we got some gozukis running around in here we got the shadal engine and we got some zombies so that's all right with me so yeah uh, it's not really too much to explain i'm pretty sure if you guys have been watching this channel or keeping up with Yu -Oh in general you guys know what most of these cards do uh i'm just gonna go over a few cards that might seem you know unfamiliar with you guys and i know this one because when i first seen it i didn't know what the hell it was but this what it is uh I, I believe this is the card so yeah it's target one synchro monster you control this turn if a monster uh if a, if, a, if, if this synchro if that synchro monster you control uh attacks an opponent it shuffles it i mean attacks the opponent's monster shuffles it to the deck um before at the start of the damage step and then if a starters would tribute start a synchro monster would tribute itself to activate its effect you can banish this card from your graveyard instead so that means if we get a starter's dragon on board we can pretty much tribute twice and another good thing is when you go for starter's charge warrior and you use this on it it, it can attack everything so that means you put everything back to the deck. So that's a good little nifty combo that you can do with this. Now, the only card, I, be, I mean, the only extra deck card that probably should go in here and we're probably going to end up replacing the Spark Dragon is for uh, Shogun Saga because um, the, the, the Spectral Sword going to Shogun Saga is just amazing. And we'll probably throw in the Sun Saga also because, like I, I, I really, not like I said, but I really love that card. I really like it so i don't know what else we're going to be able to cut for it um maybe a clear wing because three level sevens is a bit much maybe one of these uh and then we and then a spark dragon like i said or you know we i don't know about stardust dragon because cosmic flare cosmic flare seems like a very fun card to you know use and stuff like that so we're definitely going to give it a try but yeah those are only two cards that i, I would believe we're missing because we do we also we are running zombie world so I, that really doesn't it kind of counteracts you needing a zombie synchro but sometimes you know you need that zombie synchro and uh yeah let's go over fiend comedian which is pretty much you toss a coin and you call it right you either banish if you call it right you banish your opponent's graveyard um and if you call it wrong you mail the same amount to the graveyard and then needle bug nest which you send the top five to the graveyard and that's pretty much yeah that's it so without further ado we're going to just hop straight in uh to the video and before we get into the video i'd like to say if you guys do enjoy the video leave a like leave a comment and also subscribe if you have not already and if you guys can click an ad to help support the channel which would be very helpful and i appreciate it very much so without further ado let's hop straight into these and i don't know if i already said it or not but shout out to random ix for sending in, sending in another deck that uh that it looks pretty fun to play and it looks like we're going up against a normal deck because uh, when I first started testing this deck, when I was trying to record the first time, um, it, it, it was the worst thing I've ever had. Like, it shit, everybody kept disconnecting. As you see, like, it's it's like a little staticky. And look, we're running at a smooth 60 frames per second, but I don't know why it's stack staticky. It just started doing that. So I'm guessing that um, it's an update that they did, um, Yu-Gi-Oh! Pro did or something like that. Because I don't know why all of a sudden that I'm just getting static when i'm you know recording or anything like that but it looks like we're going up against ddds so let's see if we can destroy this now we do have a decent hand we have a needle bug's nest we have a unizombie and we also have a shadow beast and a rise at a full height so let's see what this man can do let me see opened up you know they always open up the same exact hand a ragnarok right i'm guessing it's a ragnarok right no it's a copernicus and copernicus sends a what a dd to the graveyard or a dark contract card i'm guessing he's sending lamia and then with lamia he's going to probably send this and special and then get this and go uh what's the name go formula and actually he probably oh wait he's going to use the effect now well it doesn't really matter he's just still going to get the same exact stuff but um yeah and also on wednesday i don't know what i'm going to play so if you guys can leave a leave a comment, let me know what you guys would like to see me to play, or anything like that, because I do not know. So if you you know if you guys do is you get chance, because if you guys do want to see me uh, do something, I mean play something, then, then you know just go ahead and leave a comment or 
I'm just going to uh, just think of something random, something out of the box, something fun. Maybe, probably Fortune Ladies with the new spellbook of Rudra because, I mean, it works for any spellcaster, so I believe it does. Yeah, I think you send a spellcaster and draw two, so definitely might be trying that out because that seems like a bunch of fun to get a whole shitload of draws off. And wow, I just said draws off. All right, we're going for a sick free, which we can easily out depending on what our opponent does. And it doesn't look like he had to, I mean, he can easily do this too. Okay, well, he's going to do the Necro Slime. Hopefully, he does not have a young bad known as back row. Hopefully, he doesn't have back row. So, if he does have back row, he might be in a little trouble. And he plays Vanity Fiend because that's a thing that people run. Um, Regeki. Oh, okay, that works. Um, we can definitely do that. Hopefully he does not have anything. All right, he looks like he doesn't. We're going to draw a card first because we're going to see what we can do here. Let's go ahead and use this Shadal Beast. Hopefully we draw like something like a... Well, that sucks. Um, and then I guess probably shouldn't be targeting itself. Um, let's go ahead and send. Hmm. Let's go ahead and send Mizuki. Let's shuffle. Let's do this. Because that that really sucks. Don't tell me you got a twin twister, because that's gonna fucking burn my hole. It's gonna burn me a hole. Don't have twin twister, please. Thank God. Okay, so what we can do here. Is we can definitely activate Needle's Bug Nest. Right? And then we can prompt him to negate this. What the fuck does that do? Oh, no. It's possibly not going to negate. He's going to negate my Needle Bug Nest, but that's fine. What do you do? I don't care about you. Wow. You chose that card out of everything on the block. You chose that card. You chose that card of everything that you could possibly have done. So we're going to do this. And, um, hmm. What do you do? Destroy to the graveyard. Okay. So I don't, hmm. I have to get rid of this. I don't, I don't think I care about the back row as much because I can probably. I can possibly mill what's the name? So let's go ahead and just do this. I can possibly mill Dragon or Squamata or something of the sort. Um, I probably should have killed the Vanity Scene first because if I mill a Falco, then I can possibly summon to protect myself. But it doesn't look, you know, it doesn't look too good. Um, let's go ahead and mill Banish this, and yep. And Shadal Hedgehog. Okay, well, let's go ahead and do this. Pop that. And, oh, I didn't even need to pop. If I would have taught the back row, I would have been fucking in trouble. Because that would have been a fucking terrible thing to do. Let's go ahead and grab Squamata. Because I believe that's that's the good card that we should definitely just... Um, definitely put in the graveyard. And what do we have in here? We have a Rise. We have a, oh, yeah, we're set up. We're set up for next turn. I believe, yeah, he, he's losing. He's losing this. Oh my god, and I drew a Regeki. Look at that. But I believe he has what's the name in his hand, right? Um, see, this is the problem. We don't have a what's the name. Let's just get you because I believe he has I think he has a what's the name is a maxi. Is it a maxi? Yeah, see, I, I it was a maxi. I had I had a feeling. I had a feeling. So that's cool. We're gonna just normal summon the squam. No, I don't even think I want to. What's the most damage? I can do 31. Yeah, I, th I, th I think doing 31 is... No, I want to keep that because... I don't know what to do. This is a card, right? Okay, yeah. That's definitely what we're going to do here. Use the Squamata to go ahead and send a... a Shadar Core. And you know, we're going to give him a couple of... Actually, we're going to give him a couple of... Uh, what's the names? We're going to give him a couple of um, draws. Actually, we're going to give him two more draws. Because we pretty much locking him out. Uh, because of, uh, what's the name? You know what? We don't have to give him two draws. 
We can only give him one more draw. And no, no, we're not going to do that here. Um, yeah, we have to give him. We have to give him at least two more draws, because what I want to do is end up with Omega on the board. And we're going to put you in the graveyard because that looks like it's just a fantastic thing to do. Um, let's go ahead and go into an Omega right now. And that's fine, you know, because we do have a Shadal Fusion. We do have a Rise of the Full Heights. Um, oh, yeah, and also another thing that's missing from this deck is the Snow. A Snow would be very good. Now, we can go ahead and just put this back to the graveyard. Because we do have Rise of the Full Heights, we're not dying this turn. Unless it's a, even, if, even if he does give me a Kaiju, I'm still not dying because... Um, I can still just target my I can still target the kaiju and once the kaiju dies that's it he doesn't get to kill me so what I'm thinking is even if he does go off I can use Omega chain rise of the full heights um, yeah I don't care about that sir you can add a face up okay that's fine like I said if he does anything from the extra deck should all fusions ready I have a rise of the full heights because that's not going anywhere if he does bring any problems, there's a Regeki. I also have the, you know, the two stars, so we can go Crystal Wing ourselves. We, we, I think we have everything set up right now. And I guess the only thing he can really send is a is, is the Necro Slime, and I guess, or he can send um Necro Swirl Slime. Is that what it's called? Yeah, he can send Swirl Slime. I, I feel so sad for DDDs. They waited that long to come out just to get neutered by the new fucking ban list. Okay, he does send Necro Slime. That's fine, because like I said, we already have everything already situated. I don't think there's anything the Dark Icarus Silver can do to get out of this. So, oh yeah, that's another thing I was supposed to mention in the beginning. If you do hear like a background noise, this is my AC. It's, it's, it's very hot. All right, that's a five and that's a six. Okay, you cannot pendulum summon anything. So I'm not tripping about that. Um... I want him to actually go to the extra. You know what? Let's. Uh, we don't know what could possibly he bring. He could. We don't know what he can possibly bring out. So let's just go ahead and do this now. And we're gonna go ahead and get rid of a. Oh, a solemn scolding shit. That would have fucking hurt. So this is cool. He can go ahead and bring out. Um, he can bring out a. a, a, a what is that one? It's the one that requires three of them. And he does he, wait no because two of them are the same name. That's one DDD. Oh, he does. He did do it. Okay, he went. Wait, what? Okay, he does that. But I don't. Does this get this does get something back? But he doesn't have anything. Oh, okay. That's that's a good card, I guess. I didn't know you can do that. I sure didn't. And okay, you take damage and you gain it. Once again, these are all different levels. So unless there's a Lamia being dropped on board, yeah, you can't. You, it's not really too much you can do, sir. You can't attack. I don't think he understood that. Okay, so yeah. Um, all right. So what we can easily do is just start off with the Spectral Sword and banish the Sage, because there's no more Maxi. Uh, I, I really don't know what the fuck he can use right now. I'm going to use solitaire to go ahead and get this back. And this is a, another reason why we can easily like just put in a, what's the name? What the fuck can you, oh, you can, okay. That's what they're, they keep asking them about that. Now, yeah, th this game is completely over, folks. Um, we're going to just go crystal wing and then we're going to go shut off fusion. And that's going to be the end of that. There's no more maxi, so I don't know what he's waiting on. I think he's just... Seeing if he can, he's going to activate that. But th once again, this is another reason why Shogun Saga would be amazing, is because of this. Now we can easily just Scarlight and blow the whole board, but no, that's not fun, is it? Is that real fun, you guys? That's not too fun. And even if it, if I do destroy this, it still is going to resolve because this is the one that was special from the extra deck. So, yeah, I think we're, I think we're all just fine right now. He's going to just let it happen. Now let's just go ahead and go Shakunaga. Let's go ahead and just send, oh, let's send Gozuki. And let's go ahead and send uh, the young Hedgehog. Let's just go ahead and do all that, because that's just fun. Hedgehog and Gozuki. Bam, bam. Uh, we can just punish this. 
and Hedgehog can just go ahead and summon. I have not normal summoned yet this turn, huh? Oh, sadly, we don't have a... Uh... Let's go ahead and grab Shadow Beast. Sadly, we don't have a, the Cosmic Flare because that would have been amazing. Let's go ahead and just special summon this in defense mode. Uh, oh, we may draw into it. We may draw into it. And that was a mistake. I probably should have uh, special summoned this because I did not know if I can... I did not know if I did already... Uh did already um special summon let's go ahead and use this let's go ahead and uh search let's just search first and then draw so we can thin out our deck hopefully we draw the cosmic flare so we can just attack through everything that would be amazing let's go ahead and grab this icarus attack because once again we could still and there's a zombie world let's just let's just activate the fucking zombie world because that's just fun all right so it, it, yeah i'm going too far I'm, I'm sorry you guys i'm sorry you guys i got a style on i, I love playing decks like this it's so fun um, what can we get back? Um, we can get back Shadal Beast. <laughs> we can get back something from his graveyard. All right, so let's just end this off. Let's just end this off. Let's just not even. Let's just not even do that. Yeah, let's go ahead and just finish this one off. All right, so here we go with the second duel of the day against Petra, and um, uh, possibly this may be the last duel depending on how it goes. So I probably should have wrapped that up a lot faster. Let's go ahead and go first. Did you draw a maxi? You fucking bastard. Do you see what I gotta... Yeah, I, this is what I gotta go through, man. Like, come on. Like, maxi... Oh, that card should just go ahead and get banned. I don't know what the fuck... I mean, it could be a maxi. It could be something different. It may be that Ghost Ash card, which fucking sucks. Now, there's the Squamata, so I believe I'm going to be using that. All right, let's go ahead and send this young man known as Mizuki... Let's go ahead and send Squamata. We're going to use Squamata and get a beast to go ahead and get a draw. And we have a Bewildering Wind. Actually, a Lost Wind. So, I mean, I believe we're good from effects. Um, and we put something dead in, uh, what's the name? Ooh, I should get a Hedgehog, but you don't really have anything else to continue with. Um... All right, well, that's awful. That was an awful draw. But you know what? It's cool. Um, one Lawn Mooring can change everything going on right now. Uh, a Shadal Fusion can change a lot. There's a lot of things that can change stuff. Hopefully, we're not going up against uh, fucking Dinos because I really don't want to play against that deck. That deck is very scary. And he has the lone MST that's just, oh, so lovely. Oh. And you know what hurts? I think, what? What, what, sir, what the fuck? Are you playing sub terrors? Okay. Hmm. I, I don't. I don't know what to do. We're missing coral dragon. That'd be amazing. I, I really don't know what to do. I could have just, I could just attack, but something's telling me to go off. Um. All right. So what do we play? Hmm. Hmm. Let's see. What can we do? We can go go Zuki. We can go go Zuki and send that. But once again, we can't really do it. Actually, we, we can do a lot with this. Yeah, let's definitely send go Zuki right now. Let's send go Zuki right now. I really believe that he, he has a fucking maxi in his hand and it's going to hurt. Okay, I, I don't know what I. I don't... What the fuck was I thinking? Oh, that's what I was thinking. Okay. Let's go ahead and go go Zuki. Hopefully, he does not have the Maxi. Because then we'll be out of luck. Oh, my God. He fucking has the Maxi. You just can't beat people with Maxis, man. You can't. There's nothing you can do. You know what? We're going to go ahead and send... Where are you at? We're going to send this, so... Nothing really. Oh fuck! We we do run what's the name? I forgot we ran Minerva. Let's go ahead and attack this. We do run Minerva. We definitely could have did a lot with that. What is this? Oh, we're playing Lavals. We're playing Lavals. Wow, Lavals. However you want to say it. You know, I think we're gonna we're gonna set a dragon. Cause I I don't want to even give him anything else to do. Uh, but the play was send sage normal this get that back tribute this off go to the two and the, oh okay well that's fine okay 
So you literally just had no plan to do anything. Okay, well, let's just go ahead and get this. Um, what is that? Uh, that's 3,000. And that's uh, that's a game, isn't it? Yeah, that's 3,000, and that's... Um, if it's not game, we can get game, so it doesn't really matter. And watch me run into a, a square crow, a battle fader. Oh, he doesn't have it. Um, yeah, so that's 3,000, and that's 36? Yeah, so that's, that's 66 we're going to be doing. And he doesn't have anything. Wow, that's crazy. That is crazy, man. I, I feel sad for Lavos too, but fuck that deck. I, I lost to Rekindling so many fucking times. It's not even fucking funny. It's really not even funny. So we're going to definitely get one more duel. Because this one was relatively short. And you know what? What the? Oh, shit. I done forgot what the hell I was going to say, man. I had something to go ahead. and I had something straight up lined up for it. But I go show ahead. And, I mean, I went ahead and forgot. All right. We're going to go against Dance King 1711. Let's see what he's playing. Is that a DDD card? No, it's Supreme Gate Infinity. All right, so I, I don't know anything that's going on. So if I lose, don't, don't get mad at me. Oh, they got a Stratos. Oh, okay. Oh, okay. That's, see, that's balanced. If this card is in your graveyard, you can spell some of this card. But you can only activate one. See, that's balanced. Thank you. Some good shit. Good balancey. Okay, well, this is horrible. Let's go ahead and set that. Um, fuck, I really forgot what the hell I was going to say. Okay, what was I talking about before? Like, we were playing against Lavos. Um, I have no clue what I was... I have no clue what I was uh, going to say. Um, that's fine. Nope, don't need to do anything in damage step. We can go ahead and use this to go ahead and get... Ooh, we should get an El Shaddaa fusion, huh? Yeah. Let's get an El Shaddaa fusion. I feel like that's a lot better than just a regular fusion. A lot better. All right, so what we can do is draw... Okay, now that's really good. Um, hmm. All right, so we can do that definitely. We can definitely go into a Grista. And I believe Grista is the best option. Grista and this... We'll go. This is Squamata. Um, I kind of want to send Dragon, to be honest with you. I kind of want to send Dragon. But I don't know if I should. I kind of want to send Dragon just to pop the back row. Um. Well, yeah, let's just do that. Let's just do. Okay, what happens? If you control, what's return? If you have. You can destroy both cards and add one polymerization. Wow, that's amazing. Is that once per duel? No, oh, once per turn. Jesus Christ, what do you do? Holy fuck. He was trying to whip my ass. Alright, so let's do this. Let's go ahead and grab this. Let's go ahead and go to a charge warrior. Hopefully we draw that crystal, f that, that cosmic flare card. That'd be fine. Oh, wait, no, that's a breakthrough skill. Okay, so that's cool with me. Um, this card is pretty good, but sadly, it needs to be in the graveyard. But it, it is a balance effect because even if you do bring it back, you cannot you cannot use... You know what? I probably should have used Zombie Master, but one, that would be wasting a lot of cards that I don't have right now. Um, I could have kept the two. I mean, yeah, it's, it's for what it's worth. This is pretty much the same thing. But, um, yeah, yeah. Uh, this shit has to be in the graveyard, so that, I mean, he can't really pendulum summon, and I have an effect negator, so I, I, I should, wow, fucking lights warrants, okay, that's smart, okay, see, look, he can bring it back now, but he won't be able to use the actual effect to search, because you can only use, oh, no, never mind, it, 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 you can search, okay, well, that's fine, I'm not tripping, I am not tripping at all, folks. Not tripping at all because he cannot pendulum summon, so I'm I'm I'm, I'm cool, and I, I think he's gonna realize that right now. Wow, he's just having they're all level seven or something. They are all level seven, huh? That's amazing. That's pretty good. I mean, he can't tackle or anything, so I don't know if I should use Grista right. Let's just see what he does first. If he, if he pendulum summons massively, then I will use Grist Grist ah, Grista. If he only does two. 
Um, I might no because then he can just use the effect. Wow, you're just not even going to penalize him summon. Ooh, Fiend Comedian, though. That's really good. Um, let's just go ahead and tack. I don't even know what else to do. I mean, we keep putting him in the extra deck. He doesn't have him in the graveyard, so that doesn't work. Um, Coral Dragon, Brio, all this stuff would be amazing. Coral Dragon, is, I just love that fucking card. Um, so now we can either mill, what is it, six or is it nine? I'm not too sure. It is six. Okay. That's fine. Is this a dragon? Don't tell me it's a dragon. It is a fucking dragon. All right, so here we go. We're going to go ahead and call Tails. No, he's going to go ahead and do this first. Oh, wow. He's going for a massive pendulum summon. Do you have a strike? Don't strike me. What does that do? Well, let's go ahead and call it. What? If you have two cards in your pendulum zone, target two monsters in your graveyard with a level. What? Wow. That is fucking retarded. But let's go ahead and activate. Think me and what else are calling tails? We're calling tails. And it was heads. Fuck. But we did mill five, so that's cool. Let's go ahead and send this. Let's use Shadal Beast. Let's use Shadal Squad. Oh, oh, oh. Fuck. Um, I don't even know what's in my grave, and I don't know how to check. Okay, we're going to go ahead and. We're going to send last. We're going to draw. Gonna, actually, we're going to draw second, and we're going we're gonna to search first. Definitely going to add first because I don't know. I don't even know what the hell's in our graveyard. Um, Squamata, let's go ahead and add Beast. Beast is a fucking very fun card to have in your hand. Then we're going to get a draw, and then we're going to go ahead and send possibly Shadal Core, but no, we're going to send Dragon. He's already Pendulum Summon, so does I think it mat Does it matter? I think it does because yeah, that does that. Okay, so let's go ahead and there's not really too much you can actually do in the first place, but you definitely don't. I don't really don't want this man to act. Add back the young Palmer. I mean, add a Palmerization or a fusion spell. That's pretty much what's the name. Okay, well, that's fine, sir. I can't stop. Oh, wow. You can just add another one, huh? Well, that, that sucks for me. And, yep, he can add any. He can add Brilliant Fusion and just be all right with it. Because we missed. But it's fine. Just once per turn? Oh, that fucking sucks. I mean, we did the right thing. There's nothing really we can... There's not really too much we can get around for that. I mean, we did the right thing. Oh, a Cosmic Flare. That's in a graveyard. Wait, you know, he has the Bravo Oh, shit. I sent a lot of good shit. Um, oh, wow. That's amazing. Yeah, we're, we're, we're straight. We're straight. We're straight. He has a Rise of the Full Height. So, we can make him attack this Grista that he probably doesn't want to do. Um, see, a, a, mm, mm. we can get that El Shadal back. If we can go, uh, what's the name? Yeah, we can do a lot. This is, I think we, we, we can still win this. We definitely have a, oh, we have a definitely, we have a real good chance. We have a real good chance of actually surviving this one. All right. So, all right. Uh, what do you do when this card is single? Okay. Well, that's not going to happen. Um, just going to go ahead and do this. Right, and you know, just for the fuck of it, let's go ahead and activate this now before I lose. Um, yeah, let's definitely go ahead and activate that now, because if I lose, I mean, if he finds a way to kill my cards, then we're just in trouble. Let's see what he attacks. Yeah, okay, he attacks. Him. He's attacking Grister, which is a dumb move, but hey, um, that's completely fine with me. That's exactly what the hell I wanted him to attack. So that's good with me. We're definitely going to go ahead and grab this El Shadar fusion. Hopefully we draw into a lawn mowing. Um, <clears throat> and this card is okay. Well, that's just amazing right there. Don't even don't even need to. Uh, let's go ahead and go into a Shakanaga. Send these two. We'll go. Let's go ahead and get a draw. Let's go to use that. Then we're going to use Gozuki to go ahead and banish the Spirit Master and Shadal Beast to go ahead and draw. No need to chain anything. Oh, and we draw a Book of Life. That is just amazing. That is just amazing. That's just ridiculous. And I believe this is it, right? What else do we have in here? Um, We don't have really too much stuff to do, but 
you know what i think that's i think that's good i don't, I don't know if anything protects him i'm just going to attack and uh, we're going to end the duel right here we're going to end the video on a, on a good note don't want to keep doing stuff don't need to overextend when you don't need to um but yeah thank you guys for watching hope you guys did enjoy it i really had a lot of fun thanks to random my ex once again for sending in the deck list so uh yeah uh to you guys tomorrow uh with another video